no professing Christians who won't mention Jesus' name. They hide behind excuses and are filled with fear and shame. Their pride prevents them from a blessing that we all should claim. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to preach the gospel and to praise His holy name. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. And whether in a pulpit or in public on the street, I'm glad to lift up Jesus' name to everyone I meet. I do not want their blood upon my hands on Judgment Day. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. Now when we speak to sinners, we must have a broken heart. The world, the flesh, the devil are all tearing them apart. The precious blood of Jesus will remove the sinner's stain. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to preach the gospel and to praise His holy name. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and His saving grace proclaim. Wrote that song back in 1997. And we're looking today at Romans chapter 1 and verses 15 and 16, where Paul says, So as much as in me is, I am ready, I'm ready to preach the gospel to you that are at Rome also, for I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. He was willing to die, and he eventually did die for the gospel. He was willing to do that. For it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believeth, to the Jew first, and also to the Greek. This is still the case today. The gospel of Jesus Christ is powerful. The preaching of the word of God leads uh, men and women and boys and girls to repentance and they come to God through Christ and they're saved the Bible way and they're shouting and praising God in the presence of the angels. This is the most exciting thing that can happen in all the universe. Think about that. And I'm not ashamed today. How about you? I, I want to stand up for Jesus. How about you? I want to say a good word every opportunity that I possibly can say a good word for Jesus. Let's pray. Father, we pray for those opportunities, for those open doors. I pray right now that you will help us to speak to the first person that we possibly can today and to someone every day and help us to win someone if we can. And Lord, at least uh, every, every month or, or every so often, bring someone to church and let them hear the preaching of the gospel and not be ashamed. Lord, help us as we're with those that know us best, our family and friends, loved ones, our coworkers, and help us to be bold in the faith, we pray. With heads bowed and eyes closed, do you know Jesus as your Savior today? If you don't, would you be the one today that will call on Jesus? Right now, pray from your heart something like this. Dear God, I admit that I'm a sinner. I deserve to pay for my sins. I believe Jesus died to save me, and right now I receive him into my heart and life as my personal Savior. And if you prayed that prayer, he'll take you to heaven. He'll save you. Let us know that. We'd love to help you as well. With heads bowed and eyes closed, Every soul winner, renew your vow to be a soul winner today. And everyone that's going through struggles, let's cast our cares upon Jesus. Lord, today we want to give you every problem, every burden, every difficulty. And Lord, we bring it to you knowing that you'll hear and answer according to your perfect will. 
in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, sing that with me. I'm not ashamed. Sing it with me. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to preach the gospel and to praise his holy name. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to stand for Jesus and his saving grace proclaim. God bless you as you proclaim His saving grace today. You are listening to From the Shepherd to the Sheep Daily Devotionals. This is a ministry of Central Baptist Church in Woodbridge, Virginia. If you would like to learn more about our ministries, you can find us online at cbcwoodbridge.org. You will also find many other helpful resources there, including preaching, devotionals, and songs. We thank you for listening to this devotional, From the Shepherd to the Sheep.